Dave Matthews Band is a powerful, intense, sprawling talent, but it also takes the right kind of nurturing and professional guidance. The first couple of uh, rehearsals, it was a strange sound that came out, but somehow it fell together and made something that none of us expected. Dave was listening to all these players, thinking in the back of his mind, I want to have a band, I want that guy. Leroy Moore is an incredible uh, saxophone player. He was playing swing, he was playing funk, he was playing fusion. It's amazing it could have come together because everyone is so different. It's, it's uh, sort of strange. That's a pretty cool bunch of guys. And uh, how I ended up in here, I don't know. <laughs> it is sound check time in New York City's Central Park. The Dave Matthews Band takes center stage on the Great Lawn. The event is expected to draw upwards of 100,000 people. You know, playing live and records, you know, they're two very different things. And uh, so, because when we play live, it's like carte blanche. Everyone is open and free to express themselves, really, however they like. Mm -hmm. For years, uh, I didn't even know the words to any of the songs. So uh, then one day I'd hear, oh yeah, right, that's cool. Yeah. <laughs> that's, that's really nice, yeah. That's special. That's, that's special. special. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, for, I do for, know. For years and years, I didn't know the words to some of the songs. <laughs> oh, well, we, see, the we, thing we is, went to the studio and tried to do the song, the producer said, <laughs> What are you singing? What are you singing? What are you singing? Everybody was singing something different. And we've been playing the song for four years. <laughs> Really fired up every day you wake up and every time you step on the stage. Not really. It's uh, I get tired. Me personally, I get tired sometimes of uh, of all the things that are not musical. But I never get tired of you know the two or three hours that we have each night when we're actually playing and doing what we do. You know, I could do that every night and be fine. There's all the other bullshit. I mean, others. <laughs> It's the other things that are, that sometimes get hard to, to deal with, you know, and, uh, but, you know, uh, we're getting better at those things too and, and understanding how to deal with them. You know, a lot of things go with the territory and we've been very fortunate and very lucky, all of us in our lives and in our careers, and, you know, and the people we've been associated with, so, you know, these days, they're not even hiring at the post office and McDonald's as much as they used to. <laughs> so we want to sort of keep this going, so, uh, <laughs> yeah.
one good friend, Leroy Moore, on the soprano saxophone. <laughs>